You said that Arlington was more dangerous than Dallas. Yeah, it was. It uh, was. It, 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 um, no, I think it still is. It still is. Yeah, because uh, you right in the middle of Dallas and Fort Worth. You right in good. You right in the middle of poverty and and being successful. In your five minutes away from Dalworth. Yeah, you you five minutes away from Dalworth, and so um, you know, you got a mixture. It's like a tornado. You got hot and cold, and they make this big ass storm that come and swipe. So uh, I believe that uh, Arlington is the most dangerous city in uh, in uh, in in Dallas and Fort Worth. You know, Dallas and Fort Worth are going to watch this interview and this is going to go viral and they're going to laugh at you? I bet they will, but then if you just take the statistics, Arlington got more murders than any city in Dallas and Fort Worth. I have watched a bunch of good kids in Arlington go to jail for murder. I have watched a bunch of bad kids go to jail for, for murder. I have watched a guy, I have watched people go to jail for murder in Arlington that ain't realized what he had going on. Because to, to be real, to, to be honest, real with you, outside of Mo 3, hold up, outside of Mo 3, the only gangster rapper that came out of DFW, real gangster, not no look just doing thing for clout, was Tay K. And he he was right there in the mix of North Arlington. You know what I'm saying? All the other boys that were sitting there doing that, ain't, ain't nobody was sitting there doing shit like Mo. I mean, Tay, before Mo three people before Mo, people start realizing what Mo three had going on, it was Tay K from Arlington. You know what I'm saying? And so and so. So you got to think about this. And Tay K was not even trying to go viral. He was just telling his livelihood what was going on in his the race. He was actually doing the race. You know what I'm saying? Like, so he was just talking about what was going on. And so you got to think about Arlington. Arlington got a million of those. Arlington got a million of people that sit there and move from this state to we finna go give you a better life. Okay, they see yeah. all them roller coasters. Okay, it look good. Yeah. It look good, but you got a mixture of people on uh on 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 uh on welfare, you got people that more people that's rich. You got people that you know what I'm saying. So you might go to school yeah. with a person in Arlington, and you have nothing. Your mom on Section Eight, so yeah, they had to place her in Arlington. Now you yeah. got this I, guy over here. He driving. He driving a nice car, but that guy who ain't got nothing. Mom on Section Eight. Oh, I gotta do something about that. I want what he got because people laughing at me, and he go crash yeah. out. Then you got the rich kids that people calling them soft. So the now South they gotta Arlington. prove themselves. Yeah, Arlington a dangerous place to live. But see, look, I grew up in East Arlington, and the reason why Arlington is so dangerous is because, like you said, you have a lot of people from Louisiana that yeah. live in Arlington. A lot of people from Arkansas. And like you said, Fort Worth, Dallas. Dow Worth is five minutes Oklahoma. down the street. Yeah. Oklahoma. So it's a it's a melting pot and it creates friction. Like you said, it creates friction because it's it's a hundred different cultures mixed together. Right. Right. You know, and, and Dallas and Fort Worth is kind of one, two cultures and it's it's the traditional thing. Arlington is it is like you said, it's 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 crazy. In Dallas or Fort Worth, in the hood in the hoods, you know, you got somebody to preach to you saying, you know, your my my little my my big brother got murdered or my daddy in jail for murder. And Arlington is it's not always like that. Nobody can preach to them and saying, Y'all need to stay on a narrow road. The penitentiary do. You know what I'm saying? And so, you know, you know, Arlington, Arlington, uh yeah, that's, that's, I think that was the most that's the most dangerous spot I ever lived in in uh in Dallas. And I done lived in Oak Cliff, I done lived in City Hill, I lived in North Dallas, I done lived in pretty much everywhere. I lived in Fort Worth. But And all, you and you went to Seguin. I went to Seguin. Okay, and for six months. You witnessed, and you witnessed shootings? Man, when I went to Seguin The Arlington it, Fights, Agtown Fights. It was era. a tradition of people leaving school. My first day at Seguin. You wear you wear anything you want to wear. It's no uniform. The whole the whole DFW is wearing uniform except Arlington School District. Definitely. And you got off campus lunch. So it was a tradition is when we leave school, we all finna meet up and fight on this camera. And you might get jumped, you might get your head busted, you might do this, but we all go leave and get and, and, and watch somebody get beat the shit out of and put it out and and they were using it as money. They was putting it out as DVDs. Mike Jack. Mike Jack, yeah. And so <laughs> Dallas was nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Dallas Dallas was worried about getting killed because they don't hurry about people getting killed. All the time they had no fear. They didn't give a damn. You kill somebody, shit, then he just went he wasn't gonna do life. Oh damn.
You know what I'm saying? They didn't have no, they didn't understand. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, they didn't, they didn't understand. In Dallas, when niggas left school, I mean, they was meeting up to fight too, right? Yeah, but not like Arlington. It was an everyday, it was like a, it was like a mixtape. You know how kids nowadays get out and, and go to the studio? They was getting out to fight to sell it. They was really, that's why I learned some of my business techniques at. So really, Mike Jack is really the jankiest nigga that ever came out of DFW because he was he was getting he wasn't even fighting. He was watching y'all clowns fight each other and making money off of it. Basically, what the bloggers do. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, man. Shout out Mike Jack and Diacobote too. Yeah, Diacobote, D. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah, Arlington. Uh, Arlington was a whole other beast. Did you get in any fights out there, or you kind of was just like the kid? Yeah, 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 I got, I, I lasted four months and, and went back to City Hill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all, all, I got jumped so, I got jumped so bad, all this and then, yeah, my, man, my whole, I was fucked up, you know what I'm saying, like, yeah, yeah, What did yeah. you, what did you do in Arlington to get jumped? Uh, I, I took up, I took up for the, uh, the not so cool kids. See, when I got to Arlington, everybody wanted to claim they were from Dallas. Everybody was claiming Oak Cliff back then. Oak Cliff. But see, I was raised <laughs> on that side of town, so I know you ain't from Oak Cliff. I know you ain't from Oak Cliff. I know you ain't. I ain't never seen y'all in no Carter Kimball game, so I went against them for the people that was actually from Arlington. Because, because me coming from, from another school district, it's like, these guys are really cool over here, but then you got these guys that wanted to beat us from the hood so bad. So I went from the guys who wasn't really, you know, wasn't trying to beat for no Dallas, no Oak Cliff, no Fort Worth. They were just being themselves. You know what I'm saying? You know, uh, yeah, tag team and uh, what was the rest of that click out? The pack, P A C. Yeah, yeah, F South, uh, yeah, yeah, South Arlington, kids. Yeah, South Arlington. You know, uh, F Y C B H D. All yeah. them. Uh, Lynch Mob. Lynch Mob. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I, I was, I was more cool with them. I can't speak on them East Arlington and uh, yeah, that's them Arlington from them. the apartments because the Arlington from from North Arlington, they wasn't trying to be like they were from Dallas because they was really coming from apartments. Definitely. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So you know, uh. You know, so shit. I yeah. got my name from Venice Beach. <laughs> okay, yeah. you a you a yeah. you a Arlington veteran. Yeah, I got my name from Venice Beach. <laughs> yeah, it's way more suburbs in the DFW than Arlington. You got Richardson, you got Garland, um, you got Mesquite, Lancaster. Why is Arlington the most hated? Because they in between Dallas and Fort Worth. You might come from Dallas. You on twenty, right? Headed to Arlington. You passing all these hood stores, you gotta, you know what I'm saying? You from 35, you gotta pass Big T, you passing all these hood stores, you go to Duncanville, Duncanville look okay. Then you go across that mountain and pass that lake, and now it looks beautiful out here. And you keep driving through there, then you right back in the hood after you pass it. So it's in between. You know, people, you know, people uh downgraded. Like, you know what I'm saying? People look over all this. You know, you know, people looked over all the rappers. You know what I'm saying? And then as you as you as you came out and uh they started kind of listening to Arlington rappers, but they still kind of they look down on it. They don't it's like they don't believe in it. But I mean after the even after Take K, they don't believe in it. They still hold their nuts on Arlington. Mm. 